Yeah, Sandra, 570 a gallon for diesel here in Southern California. Of course, that's a necessary evil for most truckers. And up until tonight, it did not seem that anything was really being done to help them. We keep the world going and, you know, we, we get treated. We should be on first on the list to get the, the brakes on the gas. Delante Harris is a trucker who's just tired of skyrocketing diesel prices. As the conflict in Russia with, and Ukraine continues, you know, the oil markets will likely respond by continuing to increase the price of crude oil. So we just have to prepare for, for the worst. Just 3% of America's oil comes from Russia, but half of what's called heavy sour crude stays here in California for refining. That's because there is no pipeline across the Rockies from the Permian oil fields of Texas, and shipping refined gasoline from Texas through the Panama Canal is just too expensive. So we rely on foreign oil, and that's over $113 a barrel now. It affects everybody's livelihood, though. Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of drivers complaining about how the loads that they're taking is not even paying for the gas. All of us are seeing shock at the pumps, whether it's gasoline or diesel. But truckers and their 100-gallon tanks, who supply us with 80% of the goods we use each day, are struggling to make ends meet. It makes me get smarter and more strategic in my routes and, you know, loads that I used to do further, I just don't do. I do shorter loads and uh, more of them. There are calls, though, to increase U.S. oil production and suspend gas taxes, both of which might help. But it's unlikely to happen very quickly, so wallets will continue to be drained for our near future. There's more demand, there's a reduction in total supply, so all of this is just, you know, basically contributing to these high prices in, in gas and, and diesel. But there is talk tonight that a deal could be reached in the next two or three days with Iran to increase its oil production. The experts say that that's something that could push the prices down dramatically. In Castaic, I'm Rick Chambers. Guys, back to you in the studio. 